Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May the 23rd of 2020. Well, it is titled Ghost Fungus to Magellanic Cloud. So what do we see here? Well, in the foreground, the greenish glow is actually here on Earth. And that is a ghost fungus, not truly ghostly, but called that because it gives off a bioluminescence and a greenish glow. Now that shows a little bit brighter here in the picture than it would be if you were just actually out there looking at it. But you would definitely see a dull green glow there in the night. Now up above in the sky, we see a number of things including right above the tree, the large Magellanic cloud. That is the uh, small satellite galaxy of our own Milky Way. And galaxies, small galaxies can orbit around large galaxies, just as moons orbit around planets and planets orbit around stars and stars orbit around the galaxies as well. So the large Magellanic cloud, um, 160,000 light years away, is one of the nearest galaxies to us that we can that we can see and is clearly visible in the night sky if you travel down into the southern hemisphere. It is too far south for those of us in the northern hemisphere to be able to view it. So it is something that can only be viewed from the southern hemisphere. And it is an irregular type galaxy, uh, not a, a large spiral galaxy like our own a Milky Way. It is a much smaller a galaxy, but it does have some kinds of structure to it as well. It is very uh, interesting in that it has a lot of star formation, a lot of blue coloring, much like the Milky Way. So hot stars that have formed recently. And we can see those within the galaxy. We don't see the individual stars, but we can see the combined glow of those stars present here. Now the other stars that we see in the image are actually part of our own galaxy and scattered around the sky. They're the relatively nearby stars within our galaxy that we can see. The two streaks that we see are actually satellite trails. So not meteors. You can tell they might look a little bit different than we typically see a meteor trail. But they are actually parts of satellite trails that happen to be caught in these images. Now this was actually taken with two images put together because you can't really focus on two things at once. You can't pick up the glows in, in the foreground as well as picking up all the detail in the sky. So one detailed image, a deep image to take the images of the sky to be able to see that and pick up the Magellanic cloud and the stars and another one to be able to pick up the foreground tree tree stump and the ghost fungus. So that was our picture of the day for May the 23rd of 2020. It was titled ghost fungus to Magellanic cloud. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be the Grand Canyon of Mars. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.